Hello and welcome to this video. Today we have the unboxing and first impression of a watch repair kit. Now, unlike other videos you'll find online where they open the box the day before and then they act all surprised when they record the video the day after, this is the proper first impression. This is where I actually open for the very first time. So, before we get into this unboxing, I will just ask you guys if uh, you like watches and better still, write in the comment section below uh, what is your favorite watch, how many watches you own, and later on in the video I will also share uh, this information with you guys. So, let's get this out of the way for now. While most people will be perfectly happy with one or two watches, others will like to collect them, as in to buy more watches than they actually need. Now, in my case, what I do, I just put all my broken watches in a box and before you know it, there you are, watch collector. Now, joking aside, if you are a watch enthusiast and you have uh, several watches, then you might have this problem, battery running low or the occasional broken strap. So what do you do in this situation? Do you go to the watch shop just to pay some money, waste some time and get your battery changed? Or you fix the problem yourself, in which case you will need one of these things, the watch repair kit. Now, without going into any further details, uh, I will just open this up and see what Uncle Ali has shipped all the way from China. Okay, so this is it. It's a bit heavy, so it's definitely something inside. It's textile material. Well, nothing special, nothing out of the ordinary. But let's see, what do we have inside? So, all right. Now, what I recognize, uh, this should be a case holder, this should be the case back opener, you will have some pins to fit here into this tool, then you will have um, some, yeah, some bits, some whatever you call them, these accessories, uh, then you will have the bracelet pin removal tool, this one, the blue one, uh, you will also have a basal removal tool, over here, then you have some uh, spring bar remover, should be this one over here with a larger and a smaller tip, uh, some uh, screwdrivers, some uh, pin pushers and uh, tweezers, this should be fine precision tweezers. And that should be it. I've seen some other kits which come with a magnifier uh, or with a polishing cloth with other things, but um, uh, that can be probably at a different price point and uh, I actually paid uh, 20 euros for this so um, I will not go into details about how you use these tools I will just uh, see how they feel like if they are good quality or not uh, if there are requests for a video for me explaining how to use this then um, I will do one so this is metallic Okay, this is surprisingly heavy, feels well done. Okay, this one will rotate so you can easily work with it. So this is quite nice. Okay, this is plastic.
Now the case back opener, this feels good quality and uh, you know metallic gives you confidence while this plastic part over here, well this feels really cheap and well, there's not much to it. Let's see the tweezers. Well, at least they touch properly, so yeah, it's metallic. I guess this one is good. So obviously you will not fix any Rolexes with this, or you know, I guess people that buy uh, expensive watches will buy very expensive toolkits, but for changing your battery, this should be good. Obviously, at this price point, I didn't expect much, and uh, I got what I expected. That is a uh, watch kit for casual use, for the occasional uh, strap adjustment or battery change. So uh, it's compact, it's affordable, and uh, all in all, it's not bad for 20 euros. Now, to keep the video short, I will not go into further details about uh, using uh, each of these tools. However, if there are requests for such a video, then I might record one later on. So stay tuned for that. If you've made it to this point, you might as well like the video and subscribe to this channel. You know, costs you nothing, makes me happy, so why not? And before ending this video, uh, I will answer my own question from earlier. My favorite watch so far is this um, Swatch. Uh, this is an uh, Irony Chronograph. It's uh, a very good watch and I'm really happy uh, with this one so far. Uh, again, if you guys want to know more, if you're curious about this, uh, write in the comment section and I will uh, have a dedicated video explaining and showing and uh, sharing more about this excellent watch. Until such time, thanks for watching. Fix your watches and uh, don't miss my next video. Take care.